in the world in which we are living, we are surrounded by lies, and the only truth is inside us. Right. The only way to cope with the truth, to find the truth, is to close our eyes. Right. Is to close our eyes and to start to make our own judgment. Right. Now, this is again how the most substantial truth of religion brings itself. Love is something that you find here. It's not something, if you see a lady, I mean, I'm, <laughs> yeah? The love is something that I feel here. Understanding, realization, it's all here. We have to learn now to look inwards. This is the solution. This is where truth is. And this is where Athens started. Athens, which is at the core of our understanding of our universe as Westerns, started with the idea of rationality. Rationality is here. It's not there. It's here. We understand logic. We understand math. When we understand it, we know math or arithmetic, or when we understand how to do 2 plus, plus 2. We don't copy it from the, from the board. We understand it. Athens is where philosophy started, where science started, where the poesis, the tragedy, tolerance. You don't agree with Gil Adatman, you come to debate him. This is what Athens is. Jerusalem is the complete opposite. Jerusalem is the revelation of the Torah. Rules, do and do and do and don't do and don't do and don't do. This is the core. What happened, the tragic that we are living through now is that Athens has been wiped out. It has been eradicated. We are living in a Jerusalemite universe. Ten Commandments. Ten Commandments is anti-ethical. Ethical people don't need God to tell them not to kill. They understand it on their own. Mm -hmm. 